However, today I will teach you people seven lesson of R, the box plot. We will go to R, and then first of all we will uh, set our directory that I have already uh, set that, run that, and I have already installed these my packages, so I can run all these packages, and I can provide you these packages in description box you can copy these and paste into your own R and install this kind of packages and make this kind of box plot next we need to open our data okay so I have already saved my data this uh, data A and data B uh, you can see here my data A this one you can save like this and my data B let me open my data B for you people so this is my data B this B is for multiple bar graph here we have two factors genotypes and nitrogen so we can go and open this First of all, we will single bar graph, uh, open our data. Okay, this it's already opened. And now we can run this our command that I have already made. The beautiful graph is here. Uh, you can also change uh, your values, this and this is y-axis RHL your y-axis value here you are at this infinity sign and access value x-axis value here and data is equal to your data this my data is D1 and this column color that I have chosen from you can find this from Google this color codes and the main is equal to nitrogen here you can see this is nitrogen and x lab is equal to genotype and we are here we can also put our y lab and so on we can change these uh, fonts also x axis y axis so i will teach you in next uh, multiple bar graph so now we can run our data b d2 so this is the code I have prepared to make multiple bar graph. You can also change your values uh, like this. Uh, uh, data is equal to D2. What is your data name? You can put here. And your x-axis value and y-axis value here. And what should be group? So I have this, my nitrogen treatment should be group in high level low level that should make group so I have mm, okay I can run this code and show you the beautiful graph here it is now I can teach you people uh, every step one by one first of all we will use this command a is equal to ggplot data is equal to our d2 aesthetic x genotype y gene mean y is the value x is our mm, genotype and fill is equal to our treatment different group of treatment should be filled so a this is like this you can see his picture now we will add B. B command. So what is B? Let's see. So in the B we have added error bar. You can see the error bar here. So funny. Now we will add C command. These are box plots. So now we can run C. So this is C. You can see 
but now we need to clean our background and also scale first this is for scale my f command here you can see the scale I have divided uh, uh, because my uh, y axis value is from 0 to 50, 0 to 50, and into 5 cut. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 cut. 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. Now, okay, my x axis and y axis, these commands, and the main. And now this come on. Uh, this should be show like this. Yeah, clear the background and make the each axis bold. Now you can see like this. This one. Now we need to fix fix this where to show that now we need to add the seam and ticks and also yeah. so this is my panel graph if you need these codes uh, in description box I have already copied here and pasted into my description box you can copy these codes and change your values according to your data and make this kind of beautiful graphs if you like my video you can subscribe my channel and if you have questions you can ask in comment box I will give you your answer immediately Thank you so much. Bye-bye.